Higgs, a 4-3 loss to Melbourne victory. It was so close, you were leading, but two goals late saw them uh, come over the top of you. Hey, you must be pretty happy with that performance as a whole from the group, though. Uh, well, probably overall, when we look back at it, we'll be happy, but same as any game, you cut two goals in the last couple of minutes, you obviously go home a bit disheartened, but um, overall, yeah, we can't uh, really ask too much more. Do you think the squad proved a few points themselves tonight that they can take it up to bigger opposition that they're likely to face in the uh, FFA Cup? Yeah, I suppose... That's one of the things we'll look at uh, when the dust settles tomorrow. Um, we've got a lot of players who have been around A-League squads um, and they know what it's about and once we've settled into the game, their the skill levels and ability came out so it was good to put on a bit of a performance in times and spells. Um, so hopefully uh, if we do come across uh, an A-League club, once we've uh, hopefully um, got rid of Oakley, then we'll have a bit of a confidence into the next round. Melbourne Victory obviously a very highly a fancied opponent. Is there a hint of disappointment that you couldn't push on and win the game and close the last few minutes out? Yeah, of course. Um, whether we'd have done something slightly different if it wasn't a friendly and just completely shut the game off, maybe we would have done, but um, overall we've got to be happy and obviously next time we're winning with two minutes to go, we obviously need to make sure that we win. Do you think it's been the heavy schedule that really cost you at the end there? Um, Probably not. I don't know. For the 20 minutes prior to that, we were probably overrunning victory, if I'm honest. We, we seemed like we were doing all right, but then maybe maybe it did catch up with us in the end. And uh, I think a bit of sloppiness and a bit of quality was the difference at the end. They know how to punish teams, and that's why they are where they are.